I did a video on why I've stopped doing hauls this year. Hey everyone, if you are new, welcome and thank you so much for watching and if you're one of my regulars, welcome back. A couple of weeks ago, I think it will have been about two weeks ago now, I did a video on why I've stopped doing hauls this year. And I said in that video that I have done hauls and this is a haul, it's going to be a haul, but one of the things that I've stopped doing is the grossly, um, what's the word, expensive hauls that I used to do and that you see a lot on social media. And the reason, my reason for stopping doing it is that everything has got too expensive in my opinion. All of these br like brands have got super expensive and I've stopped doing like the Chanel and the Dior hauls and every, like ready to wear because frankly, I go into these shops and I, I look at these exorbitant prices for things and I think, no, it's not worth it. I can't justify it. So the hauls I've been doing this year have been a lot more toned down where I've been showcasing products by really iconic brands and the products are actually affordable. And I've had loads of you saying to me in that last video, one of you used the word grotesque. You said, I'm sick of the grotesque hauls, particularly what with everything that's going on in the world right now. So today I've got a really good haul of items that I bought discounted, some of them anyway. So I'm gonna go through and show you those. And I'm also gonna share with you, I've got a coupon code that works. So everything I've bought from Louisa Via Roma and the coupon code only works on the app though. You have to download the app in order to use the coupon code. The coupon code is major, it's like a big coupon code. And I'll link below to the app so you can download it. I don't earn from any of you downloading the app by the way, but I'll link to it below just so that you've got it there. Um, let me, I'm gonna show you the items, then I'm gonna show you the app because actually, I didn't realize it. Although I use the app, I just thought it was always perfect when it came to my kind of style but the app actually is customized based on everyone that uses it so i'm going to show you that as i go but the first item i'm going to kick off with a handbag and as always you can tell me do i keep or do i return my top by the way is also from louisa via roma and i think they have it left in small and large uh, and if you're looking at it wondering if it will fit it's very stretchy it's fitted but it's really really stretchy so Let's say you normally take a medium, but there's only a small left. I think you'll be fine with it. And again, I'll link to this below as well. But the first item is one that I showed you a couple of weeks ago. And I wanted to show you it again because it's such a fantastic bag and the price of it is perfect. And it is this from Jacquemus. I think, I think it's called the Chiquito, Le Chiquito bag. This is in the larger size. So you can get this in a medium, and in a, like a very mini size. And I would always suggest with this bag to go with the larger size uh, of it because you can do more with it. But also, although it's larger size, it doesn't look massive. Do you know what I'm saying? It doesn't, it's not like the Chanel Jumbo, which is really quite a big bag. Uh, this is just the perfect size. It also comes with, I will show you this, comes with a crossbody strap. So it's quite comfortable to wear actually as a bag. And I've seen a lot more people carrying this bag recently. And every time I see it, I love it even more. Comes with its own dust bag. And this was around about 600 pounds. Uh, that coupon code might work on it, I'm not sure, but it was around 620 pounds, which for a full leather designer bag, how good is that? And this is it with the long handle on it. If you feel like the top handle is too much for you, they also do this version, which has got a, a like a rounded up handle, which I also think is really sweet. And I, I've i also ordered that, I will say, in like a lilac color from Louisa Via Roma, because I want to compare the two and decide which one I prefer, whether I just wanna go for a like, classic black, which I always tell you is the best thing to go for, or whether I go for the lilac, but I'll let you know how that goes. But this is it, with the crossbody strap on. The strap is adjustable, so you can customize it based on your height and where you kind of want it to sit. Yeah, this is it. It's a nice looking bag, isn't it? It's not, I, think, I think so anyway. So that's it crossbody. If you want to wear it just on your shoulder, that's where it sits based on the drop length that is um, 
that is on this at the moment. So that's the first thing. Oh, I love the price I paid for it. That's the thing. I'm, I'm done with being ripped off. I don't want to be ripped off anymore. The next thing that the app recommended for me, as soon as I saw it, I thought that is so me. That is a bit of me. Let me quickly show you the app actually and how that works before I show you this because I'm talking about the app and you might not really know what I'm, what I'm on about. So I'm on the app. This is my homepage and everyone's homepage will look slightly different because the items on here are selected based on your personal taste. So the brands you like, the style of clothing you like. Here, these are items that I've looked at previously, including this bag, which, you know, I love this bag. And if I go up here, again, this is a product catalogue of items that Louisa V. Aroma will think I like. So Paris, Texas, love that. Also Coperni, like that, and Saleron. Actually, they've got all of that right. Then if you click on view all, this will take you to the full catalog. So everything that they think that you will like is listed there. Even things like this. So I buy a lot of high-waisted trousers. They obviously have noticed that and that's what I've got there. But the one thing that's really, really good, let me show you this. If you go down here to search, up here at the top, just there is this icon. And if you click on it, it says, do you want to take a photo or upload an image? I'm going to upload an image and you wait until you see this. So here we go, I've got some images. I'm going to upload this one. And then here you will see, this is a picture of me that I screenshot off Instagram. These hotspots here, you can click on any one of them and it will show you products that look like that. Then if I go back again, I can click on the shoes and it will take me to shoes that look like those. So it's even got the, it's actually even got the brand right. These are from Match and & Match. And you can take a picture of you in the mirror. You can take an item of clothing out of your wardrobe that you really like the look of and put that up if you want to find something similar. You can put up screenshots off the internet. You can screenshot your favourite influencers if they've got an outfit that you like and it will show you on here similar items that you can buy. To check out, go to the shopping cart at the top. It's exactly like the website in this uh, front actually. And you'll see the items that I've got in my shopping cart and you pretty much just press check out at the bottom and it will take you through the payment section and then that's it you're done so this is it this is what it recommended and it's a balmain i already know i'm going to keep this i already know i'm going to keep this this is a balmain knit sweater and it's got the buttons across there like the classic balmain uh, buttons it's so squishy and soft it's it's like nothing i can describe actually it's the softest slightly fluffy wool it's not that kind of flat wool it's slightly fluffy as you can see here i sized down in this um just because i wanted it to be slightly more fitted and also i might wear this kind of tucked into um jeans and stuff like that and i'll back up in this video i'm going to obviously show you how everything looks this had the discount on it fantastic price i'm so glad i got it it's actually nicer in real life than i had it down for i thought this could be something that i return i just don't know the next item is also from jacquemus and i thought i'm gonna get this to match the bag wow i love this i'm so into choker necklaces massively you know that and this is a choker necklace that has jacquemus written on it let's try it on This is it, worn, not too tight, but also I can already tell there is the ability to stretch it depending on the size of your neck. Oh, I do like that. I think with a different, obviously with a different top that doesn't have a collar on it. I like that. I'm definitely keeping that as well. So far, so far so good. I'll link to all of this below, by the way, so that you aren't having to kind of rummage around too much. The next thing that I purchased is in here. This is from Jimmy Choo. Had my eye on these for a while and then they worked with that coupon code and that was when I decided to bite the bullet on these. Honestly, they're gorgeous. Here we go. Dust bag. And I sized down in these because normally in sneakers I size down. It's very weird. Ooh, they are these. I just really wanted a simple clean pair like clean pair of 
black sneakers with a white sole. I love that look and I saw these and let me show you some close-ups because these are actually pretty cool. Like for example, if you like this look but you don't want to go for like Adidas or like a Nike or a Nike sneaker, these are really nice. And around here, they have got obviously um, Jimmy Choo are known as well for like crystals and embellishments and it's got crystal embellishments all around the heel there. They are pull on so there's no laces on the top and I and it's got Jimmy Choo written just on the back there and on the back there in the leather. These are suede trim and then this is fabric on the top. Look at the bottom. How nice are these? And also if you want designer sneakers and again coming back to that point if you want sneakers these days that are designer you're looking at over 500 pounds i'm not joking you i have chanel sneakers which i adore and i'm glad i bought them when i did because now you're looking at near a thousand pounds for a pair of trainers you know whereas these with the discount can't remember exactly how much these were but I, they were under definitely under 500 and for a pair of like really clean looking simple looking it's exactly what i wanted and then the final item, hoping this fits uh, actually, looking at it here, maybe it should do, I'm sure it will. I found this pair of trousers on there and they're said to be high waist. I think they're going to be. I'm going to need them taken up though, I think, because they're quite long. Um, and incidentally, for any of you thinking that you ever want to buy trousers, whether it's these or anything actually, and you're worried about having them taken up and the faff of it all, most dry cleaners do it. I go to a dry cleaner and they charge me £11.50 to take trousers up and it's so, all you have to do is get a pair of trousers that you own, measure the inside leg, make sure that that's how, you, how long you want the trouser to be, take it to your dry cleaner, tell them the leg length that you want it to go to and they will do it for you. Most dry cleaners will do that so it's not a case of like you having to go and find a seamstress or anything. I mean on the topic of hauls i'm never going to come on here and tell you that i'm never going to go and buy anything from chanel or Dior or any of those places again you know i'm a massive addict to all of those brands i i love them but definitely i feel like at the moment i i just feel like when i go into those concessions those brands and i see something nice and i'm like wow that t-shirt's lovely and then i find out that it's over two thousand pounds for a t-shirt I, and that's actually happened and the t-shirt in question didn't even have sleeves, it was more like a vest. It's that kind of thing that's really putting me off, do you know that? It's that kind of thing that's making me think, no, it's not worth it. You know, we all work hard, we all wait, you know, work long hours and we save hard and it, you know, whenever I buy something, I always think, how long did it take me to work to earn that? Is is it worth that amount? And that's why I was so pleased with everything that I got in this haul. And that's why I thought I would actually share this all with you because it is the kind of thing that it's not super expensive. And like this bag is just fantastic. As I say, I've shown you it before, but I wanted to show you it again because it's fantastic and I have ordered it. So my plan is, uh, I always like to think about things before I keep them. I do like a discount. And I decided with this bag, I ordered it in this, but I've also ordered it in the medium size in the lilac with the curled up handle. I'm going to wait till that arrives and then I'm going to decide which one I like the most. I might even come back on here or do a short, um, one of those short videos and you can tell me what you think. But I'm going to make up my mind as to which one I prefer and then keep accordingly. But yeah, definitely for the price, I definitely think it's worth you going for this to be honest if you want to design a bag and you want something well under a thousand pounds and you're not having to buy canvas you know normally for under a thousand pounds you're looking at canvas coated fabric like like plastic coated fabric this you're not it's full leather i'm going to link to everything below including the app and as I say, the app's actually a really good way of shopping. It's been a way that I've been shopping more recently. The coupon code that I mentioned only lasts for three days. I don't profit from any of you using it either. So any of you using it, I don't make any money from that. And I'll put what that coupon code is in below. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.